That's regarding being a workmanship of Jesus, created unto good works. That's what I wanted to share with us today. That's regarding being a workmanship of Jesus, created unto good works. That's what I wanted to share with us today. I'd just like to say about that is this. The King James uses the word workmanship. But the Greek word that is used is the same word that is used for maybe a poem. A poem. Or a creative best. So when, when, when it comes to God and he wants to show for all of the world and everything else that has a name to see and to experience what's the best you've got to manifest and to walk in what is called good. He will point to you and point to me who has been begotten in Christ Jesus and say, that's the best answer I have for you. You know, so Ephesians 3.10, um, can, I, can I just have it? I, I, I just want to share this and we pray. Now, so to, for you to make a little more, let's speak from 8. Unto me, who am less, that's the Apostle Paul, who am less than the least of all saints, is this grace given that I should preach among the Gentiles the unsearchable riches of Christ. A little pause. Unsearchable riches of Christ. If you were to talk about the depth and the treasure in Christ, would you use the word unsearchable? To describe it what you have come to know of christ or oh, it is only is that an apple would you use unsearchable the depths in christ and the riches of christ that we find we keep finding and finding and finding and finding and finding and we will not ever come to an end of it unsearchable riches of christ verse 9 and to make all men see what is the fellowship of the mystery which from the beginning of the world have been hid in God who created all things by Jesus Christ. I, I am not going to preach, so let me move to verse 10. To the intent that now unto the principalities and powers in heavenly places Unto what? The principalities and powers in heavenly places might be made known by who? The who? The church. And what are they manifesting? The manifold wisdom of God. So if principalities and powers, demonic entities, things that rule and control want to ask God and stand in front of him and say, they call you the only wise God. Show us your best wisdom you've got. Guess what? What God, God's answer will be? He will say, Niamu, Ruby, Martin, Marion, Setuchi, Lucy, that, that. He said, the church. He said, the church would exhibit the manifold wisdom of God. Now, the question I want you to just have at your back of my mind, your mind is this. Can I truly, if I, it depends on me, reveal the wisdom of God unto anything ever in this world? To humans, first of all, or to demons and principalities for that matter? Can I? Can I actually manifold, manifest the wisdom of God? That if God is put on the stand and ask and say, show us your wisdom. So look at Prince. That's my wisdom. And if I be the wisdom of God, 
I better give him room so that he can unveil all that out of me to answer that which the world has. And we sit on such treasure and such potential and such power that we, we, we probably limit ourselves and put God in a place where he can boast about you and I. You know, God boasts about Job, right? He boasts about Job. But if God were asked today to boast about, about anybody, he wouldn't boast about Job. He wouldn't boast about Abraham. He wouldn't boast about David. He wouldn't boast about any of them. He wouldn't boast about John the Baptist. But he would boast about you and I. Me. You. Yeah. He would boast about you and I. What does that say? That we can't sleep, church. We can't sleep. We can't allow ourselves to be engrossed in anything else. We can't look down on ourselves. We can't look like some impoverished people who have no answers. We can't throw our hands in the air and complain. But rather, we'll put on our priestly and kingly garments. And we'll stand and we'll begin to deal with situations in a manner that only we can. Only we can. And it's interesting how the scripture describes the church as the body of Christ and he being head, right? Think about it. Your body without the head, the head is not functional without the body. So imagine the toe without the, the head. It has nothing to stand upon. Imagine the hand without, I mean, not being there, the hand not being there, and, and the head is there. Imagine what happens next no functionality you want to lay hold the, the head figures it out that i want to lay hold but there's no hand to lay hold i want to kick but there's no leg to kick i want to punch but there's no arm to punch i want to speak back but there's no voice to speak and no mouth to speak but we have been made the workmanship the very best that god who created the heavens and the earth and sometimes you look at the some you travel and you see some of the wonders of the world you see some of the things and you're wondering and you're like what and and all that that's not god's best creation his best creation is you his best creation is you that demons and principalities and all wonder and say you know like how they asked they they, they saw jesus and and they wonder and said i mean could god anoint humans like that that's the kind of place that God wants you and I to walk that's the kind of place God wants you and I to walk you want to declare and say that by the blood of the lamb you come you want to declare and say that the blood of Jesus has redeemed this one in the name of the Lord Jesus you want to declare and say that the blood of Jesus has redeemed this one. Not the Borosin de Lebianeke. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Kaya Bado Niri Sitende. Yina Sekenga Kula Biosinimikende. Yina Selio Ruri Bibabongate. Yite Senga Pelewa Diosonte. Yina Senga Lopriane Masi. In the name of the Lord Jesus. That the blood of Jesus. Kaya Bado Niri Biande Sete. Yina Sekenga. In the name of the Lord Jesus, that the blood that was shed on Calvary Street was shed for her. In the name of the Lord Jesus, the blood that was shed was shed for her. Mante Brasini Mikaloa, the blood that was shed was shed for her. Mante Lebre Biono So, Salamione Seliake. He said, The lion and the bear, they came after the one of the, the sheep. And someone will say that Kriba Seke Nule Biosinde Ye Nasin Tele before whom Christ has shed his blood, Kaya Biose. We offer the blood on the altar, Kaya Bade. Remanda Le Biasevides, Kaya Krosi. E Naseke Tengalia Barowa Sete. And we declare Jones, Kaya Bade. Open Malabiosont, Krasanteka, Le Rebeanda Sionoko. You know, the accounts, they say this proverb. 
If I say it wrong, forgive me. Maybe you can't have thought about it. They say this proverb that, see, there I go. They say this proverb about if death is holding a thing, no one can take it out of his hand. You heard that proverb before, right? Okay. But David said, the lion and the bear, they came for one of my sheep. He said, I ran after it. And beloved, we ran after it. We ran after it. We ran after it. Men and women born of God, filled with the Spirit of God. Ordained for good works. We ran after it. 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 And we don't run in our own strength, beloved. We come on the basis of Jesus who says that all authority in heaven and earth has been given unto me. Therefore, go in my name. All authority in heaven and earth has been granted unto me. We want to confront every authority. We want to confront every authority. We want to confront every authority. And we come in the name of the Lord Jesus. And by the blood of the Lamb. Rema Kalabiana Sata. We come in the name of the Lord Jesus. Kayadion de Lebiane. And by the blood I was shed. Marakano Sotianeke. And Madion also. He said, I snatched the lamb out of his paws. Who needs healing? He sent forth his word and healed them. He sent forth his word and healed them. Maybe your mom needs healing. Maybe your dad needs healing. Maybe your son needs healing. Maybe your daughter needs healing. But to this morning, we want to say that the Lord sent forth his word and healed our sister Sawa in the name of the Lord Jesus. The word of healing, the word of restoration, the word of healing, the word of healing. In the name of the Lord Jesus, he sent forth his word and healed them. Maria and Busa. He sent forth his word and healed them. Marabion and Manta Kayandi Zinimike. In the name of the Lord Jesus, he sent forth his word and healed them. Marabion and Mosanta Levi. He sent forth his word and healed them. And by the word of healing, he delivered them from destruction. In the name of the Lord Jesus, he delivered them from the paws of destruction. He delivered them from the grave. Marabion and Satan Delibrike. He delivered her from grave. In the name Name of the Lord Jesus, Matthew no Locranda Satande, Yena Creseta. We enforce the word of God. The word of healing. The word of deliverance. Kaya Maro Seten de Libreke. Yeseke Liane Mondi Librikea. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. You know, when Job found himself being contested over by devil and God, the devil said that it is because you have built a fence around him. If you take up the fence, you would see that I would touch him. And the Lord commanded that the hedge around Job be removed. 
presence of the Lord, the covering of the Lord, the hedge of the Lord, the hedge of the Lord. Rabiana Sante. The scripture will say that if the hedge be broken, then the serpent will bite. Krameno Rosinte. We want to declare and say the hedge will not be broken. The covering will not be broken. The shelter will not be broken. The fence will not be broken. The prison. Covering! May every sentence against your people be wiped by the blood of Jesus. Glorify your name, Lord. And show yourself strong. Yes, Lord. Among the gods, among, among the, the gods, gods, who is like thee? Manifest himself. Oh, 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 is like unto thee. Oh, who is like unto thee? Church say amen. Please take your offerings. Let's pray. <laughs> 